Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Veos and welcome to another episode. So we've got some download craft files here and the only, we only got two I can see. I haven't checked Twitter yet but I will be checking Twitter, Facebook and of course you can also message me. Now of course I can't message myself but it's pretty simple. Hit the about button and the message, send message should pop up. So I'm just going to go over here to Cruisin' AK, which has been gone for a very, very long time. Where the hell are you? Sad face. And send it to him, and I encourage all of you to do the same. <laughs> Bombard the poor guy. Now, anyway, that's how you send a message to me. A message to me. And um, if you want to send a link, there's an easy way to do this, and, and uh, I discovered this a long time ago. Mediafire. Mediafire allows you to do a free download, not free down to bleh, free subscription, like a trial, kind of a demo version kind of thing. But it gives you 10 gigabytes for free. All you do is download uh, whatever craft file from your computer, and then you can uh, copy the link and then send it to me. Boom. Done. Anyway, so that being said and done, uh, I've launched the core module with a tow truck or a little tow vehicle so uh, let's go ahead and get the first one first one is from Izzy Izzy Wakefield and uh, looks like a solar array so Izzy awesome job but remember that we don't need RCS because we have a tow vehicle up there also it will help save uh, when it comes to part count so all I did Izzy was take your beautiful creation and uh, strip it <laughs> You know, modify it. Yes, modify it. Slightly modify it. It's still its original ideal form of what it wants to be when it grows up. So basically I just took off all the RCS and that was it. Yeah, pretty much cleaned it up a little bit. Awesome. So Izzy's got a nice little solar array going on there. I hear that there's some other people making some other solar array creations. I can't wait to see them. And, uh, okay, well, I tried to put more in there, obviously, but it wasn't going to work. So we're just going to have to take it up as is into space. Now remember that the SSRT creation here is um, as close to realistic as possible, meaning there's no super duper overpowered reaction wheels inside. Uh, so everything is aerodynamic and uh, tends to be a little wonky during launch. And yes, our orbit is a little weird, but it's just going to have to do. Uh, anyway, so we've got the solar panel, everything's ready to go. Uh, next will be from, uh, shit, I'm so horrible with names. I'll just put it on the screen. But anyway, so he's got, uh, he's got another kind of solar doohickey thing that we're going to work on. And I might go and clean it up a little bit too, so we can wor not worry about park count or anything of that nature. But it looks pretty cool. And, uh, like I said, you can message me and give me the link, uh, via Mediafire or some other... Um, some other uh, program if you find it you know helpful in any way oh, I'm so tired <laughs> Deadpool tools coming Deadpool tools tool why do I want to say Deadpool tool Deadpool tools down kind of my tongue so Deadpool 2 is coming out oh yeah I like it anyway so okay well um crap was there anything else I wanted to talk about anything at all anything at all ah oh, 
exhausted. Okay, I covered the whole file thing. I covered the whole loading thing. Oh, uh, crap, 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 crap. Nope, that's it for now. That's all I can think of. I'm pretty sure I'm missing something else, but we're going to have to cover it in the next video. Thank you so much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. I am Veos, and I will see you in the next video. Signing off.